Hi, this is Melody Gray with the Houston Drama Club. This podcast is meant to help promote plays and musicals here in the Houston area. Our website is www.houstondramaclub.com, where you can find upcoming and currently playing productions. So join me while I go out into the Houston theater community to find out what's going on. Join the club and let's go see some theater. everybody this is Melody Gray and I am here at Night Court which is a fundraiser for and that's fine if there's noise in the background Uh, it's a fundraiser that's put on every year by a group of lawyers called Lawyers Entertaining for Charity and I have Brandon here with me right now Brandon please introduce yourself yeah so uh, my name is Brandon Barkas I am the executive producer of Night Court and um, we're an all-lawyer uh, entertaining company that puts on an annual musical comedy. So tell me how I got started, Brandon. Was it your idea? Whose crazy idea was it? Because lawyers are not, you know, when you think lawyers, you don't think like, you know, musical theater. I'm sorry. Yeah, what? Fair <laughs> enough, fair enough. So um, it was started uh, almost 30 years ago um, by just a, maybe just a small group of lawyers that wanted to throw on some skits and, and have fun, you know, in a in a small room, um, you know, yeah. and it's, it's grown yeah. exponentially since then. That's amazing. Yeah, I do. Uh, I'm an actor as well, and I did a fundraiser a couple of years ago called Halloween Magic, and they do a fundraiser for, like, AIDS organizations, and uh, and they had been doing it for 25 years as well. Same thing. Mm-hmm. Started in somebody's home, cabaret, you know, just something really simple, and then it has become, like, a big thing as well. So you, we are here at the Hobby Center, Zilka Hall. Had how did you guys score this venue? <laughs> I hope it was donated. Was it donated? No, it's not cheap. Oh, oh okay. Uh, but you know, we um, the whole point of the uh, of the you know uh, we, we're a five hundred one c three nonprofit, and not so cheap. every year we go out and fundraise, and part of the uh, show incorporates our sponsors into the show itself. So oh, they fun. get um, you know an advertising and marketing opportunity in the show. Sure. Uh, and, and that's always good business to be philanthropic and to uh, be seen to support your charities. Yeah, absolutely. And so uh, a lot of the legal community here in Houston, uh, we get a lot of support from them and a lot of the bigger firms and legal service providers that allow us to you know, give to over a hundred thousand dollars to each of the previous five years uh, to our legal charities, which provide free legal services um, to certain types of demographics and groups, like the yes. homeless, and, right? And the Houston Women's Center. That's I right. Think. And uh, then the uh, there's a, a veteran. I'm a veteran, so yes. I saw the it was the Lone Star Legal Aid. Lone Star Aid. Legal Aid uh, provides uh, free legal services to veterans. We also have child advocates, um, and then, like you mentioned. Um, the Houston Area Women's Center and Beacon Law, which provides services to um, you know the underprivileged and domestic abuse vic- victims and children at risk. Wonderful. Yeah. So tell me about the show. So, yeah. So each year, uh, it's an original script uh, written by a lawyer, performed by lawyers and judges, and then the orchestra uh, is comprised of lawyers as well. And so this year, and you guys are all volunteer. All Can volunteers, that? absolutely. Okay, so. Yeah. It, um, it takes uh, probably anywhere from 250 to 300 hours per wow. cast member per wow. year. Wow. Yeah, so um, it's a, about two months of really strenuous rehearsal to get ready and prepared, and that's after the day job. So it's right. usually from you know, 7 to 10.30 at night in the weeks and then all day, uh, all day Saturday and Sunday. So wow. it's, it's a big commitment, but it's really fun. These are the four days that make it all worth it. Well, that's wonderful. Well, and are you in the show at all? Are you doing anything? Okay. I am. Uh, are you I the play, master of ceremonies? <laughs> I play Baloo the bear this year. Okay. Uh, so okay. We got, um, it, it's, it's, it's been really fun. There are um, you know, all types of lawyers, not only in their area of specialization, but also you know from their backgrounds. And so we have some tremendous singers. We've got um, mm-hmm. musical, uh, what do you call it when you major in that in college? Like, Musical, musical theater, theater. Yeah, yes. Musical theater, we we right. have we have some of those majors as well in the That's cast. Wonderful. So now I, you know I'm not trained at all, but I do like to make a fool out of myself. So well, I think that's half the battle won. Right? Uh, if you're willing to, you know, make a little fun of yourself, I think that that's uh, a good thing to have for theater. So the show is sort of like a take on a couple of different amalgams. I understand that it's a jungle themed 
uh, show tonight based on like a board game right. and that there are fun characters based on like lions and what else? Yeah, well, so we've got uh, warthogs and um, zebras and, um, you know, all kind rhinos, all kinds of characters. Just, oh my gosh. Yeah. You can fill Noah's Ark with them. <laughs> well, that's wonderful. Well, it sounds like it's going to be an amazing show, and I can't wait to promote it and get this up tonight. And uh, and I'll put this out, and I'll give our my listeners more details in just a little bit. But I'm so excited. Thank you, Brandon, so much for joining me. Thank yeah, absolutely. You. Thank you for having me. For more information, visit www.nightcourt.org. They have three more shows. August 15th, 16th, and 17th at 7.30 p.m. at Zilke Hall at the Hobby Center for the Performing Arts, 800 Bagby Street, Houston, Texas, 77002. Go out and support this fine organization and help them with their yearly fundraiser. Thank you and good night.